Hey guys, welcome to the morning of day 10 of my 30 days to play series, or 30 days to die series. Um, so I built a little bit of a mine here uh, underneath the, as you can see, underneath our little derrick here. And I put some concrete around, it's still drying, uh, just because I wanted to make sure if anything breaks in and when I'm down there, it's hard for them to get down to me. I have some time to prepare. So I did a little bit of mining, not a lot. It looks like our trees are starting to grow here. It's nice to have some trees inside the walls so I don't have to go out at nighttime to get wood if I need it. So that's why I was doing that. Um, so let's go put this stuff away. Uh, what do we got here? A fire axe we need to keep on us. Uh, iron. Nothing goes in here, but in here we can put you. Got some clay. There's our concrete. We used up all the cobblestone, unfortunately. Uh, the iron we need to take out and melt. This iron can go in here. Uh, we need the wood frames. We're going to keep this. Actually, let's repair this first before we go today. This is fine. Let's bring the axe down. Shovel can stay here. Or the hammer, sorry. Um, glass jar can stay behind. We have to go out and get those supplies today. So let's drop the bicycle down. We got wood on us. Let's drop some stone in here. We don't need that. Okay, looks like we're good to go. Alright. Let's get this cooking out here. And I think we're using this one. No, that's lead and brass. Here we go. Iron. Don't have a lot in here, but we'll drop 75 in. And I figured out how to calculate how much time you need. So every 10 of these is is one is one piece of wood, roughly. Uh, it's 50 seconds, and this is 50 seconds for a piece of wood. So uh, whatever you got here, um, just divide it by 10. So eight or seven and a half pieces of wood. So put eight in. Good to go. That'll be done by the time we get back. All right, let's get out of here. Um, I should really just put something across there, but we don't need to. We can go this way. All right. We are going to go over and pick up those supplies. With any luck today, we can probably do two or three quests, which would be nice. Um, I want to start getting to, level, to tier two in the quests, so we can get some better rewards. Now, we did spec down the reward tree. If we have a quick look here um, in our skills, we went down the reward. I'm going backwards here. Uh, Daring Adventurer, we get uh, three additional choices for quest rewards. So we have like five choices now. So hopefully, I'm hoping we get a beaker, um, but I don't know, maybe we will. It would certainly be better than my last series, having to wait till like day, what, 31 or something to get two beakers in total. So having that early would be nice. And really the only thing I want that uh, the um, alchemy station for um, is gunpowder, cheaper gunpowder. We can make gunpowder without it, but it's, it's cheaper. It's half the price with the uh, alchemy station. And um, actually, let's kill some zombies while we're out here. Because this biome, I gotta say, is probably the most friendly biome. Um, if that's saying much, it's, I mean, it's not a very great looking biome, but it is relatively friendly when it comes to having to deal with zombies. You find the occasional bear, but not very often. There's gunpowder there. Yeah, so the still, uh, gunpowder, and um, the other thing we want out of the still is paint. See ya. All right, and while we're out here, we should probably look at these places and see if we can pick up some more brass. There we go. Because we are going to need that for ammunition for the future. Nice. What have we got in here? Ah, some arrows. Nice. Yeah. You know, it is the apocalypse, so I don't feel bad about taking things out of toilets. But in real life, uh, you know... I think I might pass. All right, anything in here? Ah, good enough. Let's just keep going. Actually, we know what? There's a uh, bird's nest right here. Looking for eggs, man. All right, let's. Uh, you know, we're gonna go right to steel arrows. We're probably never gonna use iron arrows. Scrap this as well. So I'm not worried about uh, hanging on to those iron arrow tips. There really isn't much in the way of uh, um, threat from zombies this early on. Now we got to worry about iron arrowheads early on. Later on, we, when we're starting to do uh, bigger quests and stuff, we'll definitely need the steel. And I would prefer you. Well, uh, 27. I'd prefer getting the steel over anything anyway. All right. 
Uh, there's a mine over there too, right? We can get some iron from there. You want to go in here? Hmm. I don't know. Let's go around it. Let's kill this zombie though. I know I'm kind of taking a really wide ass detour to get to where we're going. And if I keep doing this, we're never going to get a lot of quests done today. But the XP is definitely good. Alright, let's see if this has got any brass. No, but we do have a bird's nest. And some paint, nice. I'll take those. Alright, uh, keep going. Ooh. Nice. Okay, uh, what do we got over here? Some garbage. Alright, we got another uh, brass fitting. Nice, we'll take that. Ooh, two in a row. Nice. Okay, I should stop picking this stuff up. But we're going to be hitting the bike up on the way back, so not worried about being a little bit overloaded. What do we got in here? Nothing really. Bird's nest. Okay, that one. Alright, so it's the ones with outdoors that have the brass fittings. So let's grab this one. This one should have a uh, sink in it. You know, the burnt forest really isn't that bad. With the, with the exception of the occasional bear out here. Which you can find in most places anyway. You'll find bears, but uh, not like that last by on the... Uh, um, Wasteland by him. What the hell? What the hell happened there? Mouse scrolling, man. Mouse scrolling. Okay, a couple more free uh, bits of experience over here. He says until he runs into a bear. Ooh, nice. Thank you very much. All right. What do we got here? All right, let's just head straight there now. I know I've said that a thousand times, but this is a thousand and one. We're gonna go. You know, one of the things about this game, ooh, is, um, you know, you 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 kind of miss that there's nobody else really, unless you're playing multiplayer, right? There's nobody else here to interact with, other than the traders. Um, but it, you know, you stumble across towns like this, and you just want to, I just, well, me anyway, I just want to like build a house here, you know. And then have them spread across the map so you can go to different towns and whatever. Have different places to uh, set up shop. But I just, um, you don't have time when you're playing because if you're going to have to deal with a horde all the time. And I know you can turn the horde off, but you got to have it at least kind of on. Have some kind of threat in this game unless you just want to live in an ap apocalyptic world. But I don't know. Alright, we're almost there. Okay, so we are here. I just kind of got here. Okay, so there's the edge there. So we're right on the corner, right here. So it's probably like right here. Yep. Yeah. Right in here. This seems like a heck of a lot safer place to dig than the last place we were at. So let's get working. You know, I said... What did I say about bears? What did I say? <sighs> Why do I even open my mouth sometimes? All right, we got to take care of this bear. Uh, maybe we can do it from up here. That's a zombie bear. Is it? Doesn't look like it. They can't climb ladders, can they? Let's hope they can't. Because we are going to... He's got to go. Like, why is it the... Oh, you know where it is? Because it is a zombie bear. We're near the wasteland biome. That's why. We're going up here. He's going after the zombie? What's he doing? Alright. This guy's got to go. course. What's up, buddy? I should just shoot him, but I don't want to waste my ammo. 
Damn you. Come on, I'm over here. This was a bad idea. This was a really bad idea. Time to get the gun out. How much ammo do we have? For the pistoli. Oh, now, yeah, see, that's just taunting me. That's just taunting me. We got 98 rounds. All right. Where are you? See, he's going to knock this down if I don't, uh... Come on, I'm over here. There you are. Die again. Okay, that's some good damage. This whole thing's coming down, by the way. He's going to destroy this whole damn thing. Let's get this guy out of our way. Come on, buddy. There it comes. Did it kill him? Nope, of course it didn't. Got him. Yeah, see... There's like no getting away from bears, man. So I think he's only going to give us leather, so I'm not going to like chop him up. Look at the water. The water physics is, physics are crazy in this game. Do we have any empty jars? We do. See, worst case scenario, we could have just gotten on the bike and got out of here. Can I fill it up? Oh, I can. <laughs> sure. Let's pick up our arrow. Zzz. What do we got in here? Let's take care of this guy. Alright, let's get back to work. All right, guys, there it is. We dug out a fair bit of this area. Boom. Yeah, it sounds like we got a wandering horde just showed up. Oh, no, you know what I think it is? I think once you get, uh, once you pick it up, they spawn zombies. And that's just fine. I mean, it's free experience for us. We should get a level here. But I'm thinking if we're gonna be doing this, we're gonna have to add more points into Lucky Looter so we can get less of a range to have to search for these. Because that's, well, I mean, not, not that big of a pit, but still it's like a fair bit of time to actually go through and find what you need. So we're going to throw our bike down and get back home once we search this car. See what we got here. Yeah, we're pretty loaded down, so let's head back. I mean, we could fit more nine more items in the bike, but I hate the fact that when you do that, you can't actually pick the bike up. Because I like to be able to um, um, pick the bike up when I absolutely need to and get away, rather than having to leave it behind. You know, I should play a no crafting um, a no crafting uh, game just to see how it goes, see if we can buy and uh, find what we need to actually survive. So I think that would kind of be cool. We're gonna not gonna stop for the sinks. I should, but I'm not gonna. We gotta do another quest today. It's already 11 o'clock. By the time we cash this in, it's probably gonna be around 12:30 or so. We gotta drop all our supplies off so one o'clock. So if we're gonna have to do one, we're gonna do a clear zombies, I think. Clear zombies or uh, retrieve supplies from a location or a courier, courier satchel or whatever it's called. Look out, buddy. Oh, sorry. Yeah, you know, lying in the middle of the road is what happens to you. You get run over. Some crazy cyclist comes by and runs your ass over. Okay, so we're going to turn the quest in first. Then we'll drop all our stuff back at home. And then uh, we'll grab another quest while we're here and head out and do that one. Make sure the damn door is closed. All right, what do we got here? Wow. Tasting and brewing. What's this? Grow hops and brew beer. Our 38762 rounds. 
I've never seen this in game yet, so I'm gonna take it. Oh, uh, here's a reward for all your hard work. Check back tomorrow, and I'll have some harder jobs that you should be more that should be more rewarding. Well, oh, twelve Molotovs. Level two fire axe. We've already got club. We don't have to worry about the muzzle ta uh, tasting and brewing again. It. Muzzle break sounds pretty good. We can make Molotovs. Let's take the muzzle break. Um, what do you got inventory wise, buddy? Uh, anything half decent? Well, there's an airdrop for us today. So let's just not Go take tomorrow to get new goods daily. Yeah, he's going to have new jobs for us tomorrow. So we're not going to worry about that. Um, airdrops over there. So we're going to drop the stuff at home. Then we'll head over to the other trader see if he's got anything for us we'll come back here tomorrow it's day 10 so they will have restocked so maybe I should go back and check and see what he's got let's get all our coins too all right let's read this okay well we know how to brew hops now which uh, sure great we can make our own beer we got two points to spend um, we want better barter? I don't know. Strength, we got heavy metal, mother load. Gonna need more resources, so let's go with mother load. The more resources we can get earlier on, the better. And then I think we go lucky looter. Um, reduces, bur yeah, reduces buried treasure location. So that's kind of better. Um, a little better. We got our coins on us. Let us head out now. Kind of got everything put away, roughly. Uh, so we're going to head over to the trader again. Uh, the one down the street, though. So let's go uh, this route. And we'll get a quest from him. Got to get that airdrop, too, at some point. Hopefully it's not too far away. Ah, uh, you can stay there. I don't think you'll be there when I come back, but you never know. we got to chop down these big trees over here, too. Heads up! Get off the road. You know what would be funny? If the actual airdrop ended up inside the trader's enclave. I don't think that can actually happen, but... So you take the bike. Because if they're banging on the front door and you don't want to leave that way, you can go out the other way, right? Alright, what do we got here? What do you got for me? Yeah, that's what my wife tells me. Um, let's see what we got here. Uh, modifiers, laser sight. That's not bad for our pistol. We could probably put that on the pistol. Um, what do we got in here? Weighted head, no. Weapon flashlight, no. Yeah. Improved fittings, laser sight. Increases accuracy when firing from the hip. Installs into firearm or crossbow. I don't know. What about resources? Science, chemicals, oil, weapons, iron mill ammo. I don't want to waste my, my money on that right now. Bullet tips though. How much would that be? 460. Eh, I don't know. Not right now. Cement, concrete, forged steel. Um, I don't think. No military fiber. Candles, bookcase. We're wasting our time. Wow, 11,000 for a mining helmet. That's just crazy. We need to find a helmet light. Uh, okay, well. Hey, chili dog. Nail some chicks, chill. <laughs> uh huh. Let me guess. Let's kill if some uh, zombies with a nail gun. Before, we can get it. Yeah, I bet you can. All right, let's get out of here. Ah, we never got a quest. Damn it. Really? Ah, give us something good. What do you got? Something close by. Oh, fetch. Oh, tier two. All right, cool. Fetch. Hidden catch. Clear zombies. Let's go with the fetch. Old Victorian, eh? Help, traveler. No matter what, I'm grateful. All right, it's a different location than the 
supply drop. So it's two o'clock. This is way later than I thought it would be. Um, let's go to the Victorian house first because it's relatively close by and then we'll head over to get the supplies if we have time. We can always get those the next day. All right, we're here. It's this big house right here on the right, it looks like. All right, let's get this guy in our inventory. Switch this around. Hopefully we don't die with all our dukes on us. Let's kill this guy. Yeah, we don't want you bugging us. Just annoying. So I guess it must be... We gotta go in the back way? I guess we do. Oh, okay. That's clearly outside. I know from past experience if we don't clear the outside they're just going to come in and if I'm not mistaken we can cheat this a little bit because I think if we grab all the material first I won't loot those I'm just going to take this because we definitely need concrete now might as well grab the stone all right, let's activate. And yep, it does. So you can double loot these places. I, I, I don't know. If it's a small place, sure. But something big, it's like you're just kind of wasting your time. All right, we are all f well fed here. Let's get our ass inside. Okay. Start off this way. I feel like we've cleared this house already. Maybe it was in my other episode, my other uh, game. Okay, all quiet. I'm gonna loot a bit as we go. All right, I think we gotta go up. Alright, so I did not bring any forged iron, so we need to make a shovel. We don't have any fibers. Well, we do without it. Would have been nice to have all that, but let's clear this. If we can get some fibers and come back in, great. But Or if we find some forged iron, that would be great too. Uh, I guess we're going down. Although I really should kill this guy. Okay. Yeah, that looks uh, like there's going to be nobody coming out of that cupboard. Ooh, two of them. Trixie zombies hiding in the cupboard. Just in case. Didn't keep my arrows, eh? What do we got here? Some foul trash. All right. Uh. Oh. Hello. Goodbye. Okay. Let's grab uh, you. Sure, I won't be able to sell them. I'll ditch stuff as we go. Oh, that's nice. Wood splitter. It's only a schematic, though, so we'll have to put it together. But we should be able to do that, I think. Okay, what do we got here?
you just stay quiet for now. Uh-huh. Okay, another one. Ah, of course. At a certain point. Come on, farty boy. There you go. Come on, get up. Take your medicine. 29. Yeah, there's not going to be anything there, I don't think. Somebody's shuffling somewhere. You hear him? Come on. Really hoping for those beakers, man. They're outside. Um, let's drop this. Um, uh, that's fine for now. Oh, there's the stairs down. We better clear this fast then. Uh, okay. I guess we could have gone this way, but we didn't. All right, you're coming in the front door, which is a good thing. There we go. I'll help you in a second. Just I gotta do this first. Just hang on. Ah, uh, maybe I won't help you. You might get it on your own. I don't really have confidence, but you might. Well, we got one of the two. Come on, girl, you can do it. That was the one we didn't kill. Outside. So glad they put those spikes there, because that really helps out, eh? Ooh, duct tape. Die already. Potato seed, okay. We are getting slow. Nothing. Alright, if we got anybody else in the kitchen, they would most likely hurt us. All right, see what kind of booby trips we got. Trips, booby trips. Let's go down to the basement. I don't know if it's in the base. The uh, supplies are in the basement or not, but let's find out what's down here. Maybe we can find a workbench or something, and we can get uh, some forged iron to fix our shovel. Oh, Mo, you sneaky bastard! Oh, damn! Damn it, Mo! Why is it always you that? Fucks me up. I got cocky with them, that's why. I love how they fall up the stairs. That's somebody outside, I think. Yeah, I think they're outside. Did I keep my cloth? I did. Uh, so let's do uh, a bandage. 
Don't want this. And we'll use this. Get our max health back. We'll use one of these. And we'll use one of these. Let's just put this back in our tool belt. Keep us a little lighter. Is there anything we don't want? Let's scrap this. What do we have on? Uh, we got the same, same stuff. Make your way in. You get in here when you're good and ready. Okay, the supplies are upstairs. Ooh. Got a little Sheena E there. Big mamas. Ooh. Ah, I couldn't get lucky twice in a row. I'm just worried about there being a dog down here. I should probably turn my light off, but it's just easier for you guys to see if I leave it on. Well, at least we oh, at least we survived it. All right, what do we got in here? Some glue. Come on, be nine millimeter. No, it'll be crossbow bolts because of course it will be. Oh, okay, you can sell that. Oh, I want this here. Oh, a structural brace. Okay. Ooh, level five pistol. Let's scrap this one. Uh, let's scrap these. Um, we can take this apart at home. What do we have in here? Okay, what can we use this on? Weapon handling of bows by 10%. Do we have anything in here? We don't. Let's modify this then. Might as well put it in there for now. Let's repair this. Because we got the iron. Okay, and let's break ourselves into, what do we got up here? Some shamway. Man, I've been ditching the paper. All we're getting is paper now. What do we got here? She's like angry out there. What the hell? Oh, anvil. I was hesitating wanting to make one of those, but I don't want those. Why am I taking them? More paper, we don't need that. We need to have one slot for the supplies. Steel arrows I definitely want to keep. Let's scrap the press boy cap. Paper we can ditch. Let's go deal with her. What do we got? I don't know why I'm... I can't carry every this stuff back. Scrap this. I don't know. We might find something half decent down here. Oh, there you are. All that for that, huh? Oh, some water. We'll drink that now. High performance running shoes. What we got is better. Uh, they're worth 30, though. Scrap. Let's just use this. Okay, we got some wiggle room to drop some stuff if we have to. Oh, 18 rounds. Nice. Coming away with a bit more than we started off. Did you break... Where did you break in? How did you get... How the hell did she get in here? We gotta go. Supplies are upstairs, apparently. Alright. Oh, you came in the front door. That's what you did. You cheated. They're up here somewhere. So what did I miss? Probably in the floor or something. Huh. If we're not careful, that trader's gonna be friggin' uh Oh. Durr! That would have been easy. 
There they are. Let's get out of here. Uh, we can't go back up that way. So let's go out the front door, which is this way. And let's get our bicycle. And get back to that trader ASAP. You know this bike? It always sounds like you're riding on flat tires. Oh, I'll come and get you in a minute. Just hang on, girl. I gotta get my quest as reward. Maybe sell a couple things while we was here. All right, what do you got for me? I did. First aid kits, compound bow level two, which we already have, although it's full strength. I think these are probably the best way to go. Claw hammer. Uh, Shamway secret recipe, nah. All right, um, what do you got inventory-wise? Will you buy this? Oh, I'll get them out there. You buy that? You sure will. What about this? Yep. Uh, let's. Oh God, there's just be quiet out there, guys. Um, hunting rifle. Yeah. Want to keep that? Who does sweatshirt? We should probably hang on to. Wanted to sell those. Um. Yeah, that makes us, I mean, not totally light, but lighter. I'm going to have to keep these out. Now, I don't want to buy, I don't think I want to buy anything from you. I'll come back now. Yeah, I will. You know I will. We're going to check out the other guy tomorrow. Oh, okay, well, I'll deal with you two. You're going to supply me with some XP? I'm not going to say no. Whoops. Thank you. Let's get home. At 36 minutes. Have anybody respawned over here yet? No, probably not. I think they're supposed to respawn every seven days, but I think it's only been six. Mo, oh, what's up, buddy? That much, huh? All right. Ah, man. Lighting in this game's nice. Yeah. Trader Joel's is now closed. Well, we got first aid kits. It seems that the traders have a lot of medical supplies to give out for uh, quest rewards, which is pretty good, I guess. I mean, we're going to need that. So... Here's what we're going to do. We're going to get inside, we're going to uh, unload everything, and then I'm going to spend the evening in the mine again, trying to get some more iron, get that mine fleshed out a little bit. We're going to have to, like, figure out what we're going to do with all this stuff. Um, these should go in there, but we don't have room for them. Yeah, no. Uh, let's just scrap these. Oops. I'm going to melt them. Forget it. I'm not going to scrap them. So I'm going to need way more storage. Uh, what else we got here? Yeah, way more storage. Oh, for Christ's sake, really? I'm at the wrong door. They're banging on the front gate again. Isn't this what happened like the last time? Oh, this whole fence fell. Well, I can see you. The nurse. Oh, come on. There you go. I'm over here. Right in the asteroid. I mean, I gotta take that door down anyway at some point, but I don't want to do it right now. Oh, for... Of course. Let's hope there's nobody else around. Seems to be quiet. All right, well, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. They seem to love that front door. Um, I guess because it is a door, 
And I'm hoping that's what happens on Horde Night is that they target that front because I'm going to leave it as a door. Uh, nice big opening for them to get through. I've already melted the lead. Let's grab this stuff out of here. Um, yeah, I'm going to leave it as a big opening. So hopefully they decide that that's a good idea to go through that way. Um, fingers crossed. I'm sure they will. But uh, yeah, it's just really an iffy thing. Um, if they actually see that as a viable uh, place to go. All right, so I'm going to end the episode here. I'll sort this stuff out, do some mining, and then uh, next episode we'll pick up with some more quests. Uh, see what else we can get. We're going to Tier 2 now. Uh, make sure our shovel is uh, good, or at least we'll have some forged iron on us. All right, so until next time, we'll see you all later.